this is a quick review of two A4 locomotives I've got. One of them is the Merlin, a super detail Hornby model, and it's twice the price usually of this railroad model, which is the Falcon. They're A4s, one with a valance on the side and one without. They do vary in detail though, and I'm just going to compare them so that you can see. So here is the Merlin. It has a different form of connector underneath to the Falcon, which just uses these two metal prongs instead. Here's a comparison of the tender detail, different markings, BR and LNER. They both have sprung buffers. There's a little more painted detail on the super detail one, right up close. Not too much difference in the tenders though. Oh, actually, this one is a uh, hmm, different sort of wheel arrangement at the rear. The trains themselves, though, there is some differences. First of all, glass in the windows. There's none here on the Falcon. On the Merlin there is glass. And uh, you can see there's glass in the driver's cab as well and a little bit more detail inside. Some nice painting and etching on the side of the cab as well. And inside the cab, of course there's quite a large difference. One's painted and one's not. You could paint this yourself though. On the top, these hatches on the railroad model are fixed, whereas on here, they can actually slide open on each side, which is a very nice little touch. The Backman one doesn't do that. And these two trains happen to feature different chimneys. There's some of the side detail. So there you go, I thought I'd just give you a quick comparison, a quick review of the two types. Similar in many ways, crucially different in others. Now you can get a mallard in this sort of category, with that level of detailing. And the mallard is a lovely model to get. And that looks like the blue balanced version and that's the version that I like the most. And these are two other variations I now have.